Chapter 3 3.0 Information Gathering, Part 14. In this part we focusing on the detailed system analysis. We are going to look at fact finding, information gathering which lies in Chapter 3 after the preliminary system analysis which we looked at in Part 13. The preliminary system analysis was covered in Part 13 of this video series in this channel. If you missed check it up. In this section we looking at the fact finding which is done through. A. Interviews. B. Questionnaires. C. Observation D. Record. Inspection. Fact finding or information gathering. Fact finding is the process of gathering information and data about a particular topic. It involves researching, interviewing, analyzing and summarizing information in order to build an accurate picture of the issue or event being studied. In project report writing. Fact finding involves collecting relevant facts, themes and opinions from stakeholders in order to assess the project's viability and provide an authoritative overview of its progress. It may include field visits, surveys, interviews and reviews of documents. The results can be used as evidence to inform decision making or conclusions, ultimately increasing your understanding of the project's context who are the potential users. Gather their views. Use a questionnaire or interview or any other feasibility study tool. Information gathering techniques. Information gathering for the Marengo Sports Club system involves collecting relevant data and requirements that will be used in the development of the computerized system. The following are some of the methods that can be used for information gathering. 1. Interviews. 2. Interviews involve talking to stakeholders, including club management, members, and staff, to get their perspectives on the current system and what they would like to see in the new system. 2. Observation. Observation involves watching the current system in action to get a better understanding of how it works, where the challenges are, and how they can be addressed. 3. Document analysis. Document analysis involves reviewing documents such as membership forms, financial records, and other relevant materials to gain insights into how the club operates. 4. Surveys. Surveys can be used to gather information from a large number of club members and stakeholders to get their feedback on the current system and what they would like to see in the new system. 5. Focus groups. Focus groups involve bringing together a group of club members or stakeholders to discuss the current system and provide feedback on what they would like to see in the new system. By using these methods, relevant data and requirements can be gathered to ensure that the proposed computerized Marengo Sports Club system meets the needs of all stakeholders and is designed to be efficient, effective, and user-friendly. Sample 1. 3.1 Information Gathering the information gathering process for the Marengo Sports Club system involved several methods, including 3.1.1 Interviews The project team conducted interviews with various stakeholders of the sports club, including the management team, coaches, members, and staff. The interviews aimed to gather information about the existing manual system, its strengths, weaknesses, and areas for improvement. The team also sought to understand the user's requirements for the proposed computerized system. Advantage of interviews. The advantage of this method is that it helps to capture user requirements and understand the challenges faced by users. However, it may be biased, depending on the interviewer's skills and the respondent's willingness to share information. 3.1.2 Questionnaires. The project team developed questionnaires to gather feedback from the stakeholders who were not available for interviews. The questionnaires sought to understand the user's requirements, opinions, and suggestions for the proposed computerized system. 3.1.3 Observation The project team also observed the existing manual system in operation to identify areas that needed improvement. The team watched the registration process, inventory management, and payment processes, among others. Advantage of observation. The advantage of this method is that it provides first-hand knowledge of the current process. However, it may be time-consuming and may not capture all aspects of the process. 3.1.4 Documentation. The team also gathered documentation, 
such as invoices, receipts, and inventory records, to understand the data flow and processes involved in the manual system. Advantage of Document Review 1. The advantage of this method is that it provides a structured way of understanding the data collected and processed. However, it may not capture all aspects of the process, especially if some data is not documented. 3.1.5 Online Research The team conducted online research to gather information about the best practices in sports club management and computerized systems available in the market. By using the above methods, the project team was able to gather comprehensive information about the existing manual system and the user's requirements for the proposed computerized system. This information formed the basis for the development of the new system's requirements and design. In conclusion, the information gathering process identified the current challenges and user requirements for a new computerized Moringo Sports Club system. The methods used to gather information were interviews, observation, and document review. Each method had its advantages and disadvantages, but overall, they provided a comprehensive understanding of the current process. Sample 2. 3.1 Information Gathering Information gathering is a critical step in system analysis and design. In order to understand the existing manual Moringo Sports Club system, information gathering was done through various methods including observation, interviews, and document analysis. 3.1.1 Observation The first method used in information gathering was observation. The system analyst observed the activities carried out in the sports club, including how members enrolled, how payments were made, and how items were purchased. The observation helped to identify the different processes in the system, the people involved, and the various forms used. Advantage of observation The advantage of observation is that it allows the system analyst to directly observe the system in action and identify issues and problems. The disadvantage is that it can be time-consuming and may not reveal all aspects of the system. 3.1.2 Interviews The second method used was interviews. The system analyst interviewed the staff and management of the sports club to get a better understanding of the system. The interviews helped to identify the issues and problems with the current system, including the inefficiencies, delays, and errors in the system. Advantage of interviews The advantage of interviews is that they provide direct feedback from staff and management, allowing the system analyst to get a better understanding of the system. The disadvantage is that the responses may be biased or incomplete. 3.1.2 Document Analysis The third method used was document analysis. The system analyst analyzed the various documents used in the system, including membership forms, payment receipts, and inventory lists. The document analysis helped to identify the data flow and data structure of the system, the input and output of the system, and the data processing activities. Advantage of Document Analysis The advantage of document analysis is that it provides a detailed understanding of the data flow and data structure of the system. The disadvantage is that it may not reveal all aspects of the system and may require additional clarification from staff and management. Overall, the information gathering methods used help to provide a comprehensive understanding of the existing manual. Moringo Sports Club System, its strengths, weaknesses, and opportunities for improvement. Sample 3, 3.0 Information Gathering is a crucial step in the development of any system. It helps to identify the current system's weaknesses and limitations and determine the requirements for the new system. In the case of the Moringo Sports Club System, the information gathering process involved various methods, including 3.1.1 Interviews The development team interviewed the management of the sports club to understand how the current system operates, the challenges they face, and their requirements for the proposed system. The interviews were conducted in person and via phone calls. Advantages Interviews allow for personalized, in-depth information gathering. It enables the development team to clarify any questions they may have. Disadvantages Interviews can be time-consuming and may require multiple sessions.
The information gathered may be biased, depending on the interviewee's perceptions and experiences. 3.1.2 Questionnaires The development team designed questionnaires to gather information from the sports club members about their experiences with the current system, their suggestions for improvement, and their requirements for the proposed system. Advantages Questionnaires are relatively easy to administer. They allow for a large amount of data to be collected from a diverse group of people. Disadvantages Respondents may provide incomplete or inaccurate information. Questionnaires may not provide detailed information or allow for follow-up questions. 3.1.3 Observation The development team observed the current system in action to understand how it operates, how the staff interacts with it, and the challenges they face. Advantages Observations allow for direct, first-hand information gathering. They can provide a detailed understanding of how the current system operates. Disadvantages The development team may be limited in what they can observe. Observations may be time-consuming. Sample 4. 3.0 Information Gathering To gather information about the manual Marengo Sports Club system, the following methods were used. 3.1.1 Interview Interviews were conducted with the club manager and staff members to understand how the current system works, their roles and responsibilities, and the challenges they face in managing the club's activities manually. 3.1.2 Observation Observations were made to see how members sign up and pay for their subscriptions, how inventory is managed, and how the club's financial transactions are recorded. 3.1.3 Document Review Documents such as membership forms, financial Documents such as membership forms, financial records, and inventory logs were reviewed to understand the information captured, the format used, and how it is recorded. Findings from the information gathering Based on the information gathered, the following findings were identified. 1. Membership enrollment. The club uses manual paper-based membership forms that are filled by new members. Members are required to fill in their personal information, select the type of membership, and pay the subscription fee in cash. 1. Inventory management. The club manages its inventory of sports equipment and supplies manually. When new supplies are purchased, they are recorded in a logbook, and when items are taken out, they are recorded and checked against the logbook. 3. Financial Transactions The club manages its finances manually, including recording income from membership subscriptions, sales of merchandise, and donations. Expenditures such as rent, utilities, and salaries are also recorded manually. Advantages and disadvantages of each method used for Information gathering 1. Interview Advantages Interviews provide a deeper understanding of how the current system works and can help identify challenges that may not be evident from documents or observations. Disadvantages Interviews can be time-consuming and may be affected by the interviewer's bias or the interviewee's inability to accurately recall information. 2. Observation Advantages Observations provide direct evidence of how the current system works and can help identify inefficiencies or gaps in the process. Disadvantages Observations can be time-consuming, and some activities may be difficult to observe. 3. Document Review Advantages Document Review provides a comprehensive understanding of the current system and the information captured. Disadvantages Documents may not be up to date, and some information may not be captured in the documents. Overall, the information gathering process provided a comprehensive understanding of the manual Marengo Sports Club system and identified the challenges the club faces in managing its activities manually. The end. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for part 15 on the analysis of the requirements specification. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment if the video was helpful to get notifications once we upload more videos on Marengo Sports Club.